Welcome to Talk in English. Hi there. I've been thinking about our upcoming trip, and I believe it's time for us to start the visa application process. Oh, absolutely. I was just about to bring that up. Where do we begin? Well, first things first, we need to gather all the necessary documents. Passports, travel itinerary, hotel reservations, and of course, proof of financial means. Right, got it. Should we book our flights first or wait until we get the visas? It's generally advisable to have confirmed travel dates before applying for the visa. So, let's go ahead and finalize our flights. Once we have the flight details, we can complete the visa application form. Makes sense. Do you know what type of visa we need for our trip? I've checked, and we should apply for a tourist visa. It seems straightforward, but we need to ensure that all our documentation is in order. Let's double check the visa requirements for the specific country we're visiting. Good idea. Do we need to make an appointment at the consulate, or can we submit the application online? It varies from country to country, but I think we'll need to visit the consulate in person for biometric data and document submission. I'll look into the specific requirements for our destination. Great! Once we have all the information, we can plan a day to go together. Do you think we should bring anything else with us? Definitely. We should have photocopies of all our documents, just in case. And it wouldn't hurt to carry a printed copy of our flight itinerary and hotel reservations, too. Got it. Let's get started on this ASAP. I want to make sure we have everything sorted well in advance. Agreed. I'll do some more research on the visa application process and get back to you with a plan. Sound good? Perfect. Thanks for taking the lead on this. And let's make sure our trip goes off without a hitch. Good morning. I hope you're doing well. I wanted to talk to you about the visa application process. I'm planning a trip abroad, and I need some guidance on how to go about it. Good morning. Of course. I'd be happy to help. Where are you planning to go? And which type of visa are you applying for? I'm headed to the United States for a business conference, so I believe I need a business visa. Can you walk me through the steps? Absolutely. First, you'll need to gather all the necessary documents such as your invitation letter from the conference, your passport, and any other supporting documents. Make sure everything is up to date. Got it. I've already received the invitation letter. What's next? You'll need to fill out the visa application form online. It's a straightforward process. But be sure to double-check all the information before submitting it. Any mistakes could cause delays. Okay, I'll be meticulous with that. What about scheduling an appointment for the visa interview? Once you've submitted the online form, you can schedule an appointment for the visa interview at the U.S. Embassy or Consulate. Be prepared to discuss the purpose of your trip, your TIs to your home country, and your plans during your stay. Right, I'll make sure to prepare for that. How long does it usually take to get a decision after the interview? 
The processing time can vary, but you should receive a decision within a few weeks. If your application is approved, they'll place the visa in your passport and you'll be all set. That's great to know. Thanks for walking me through the process. Anything else I should keep in mind? Just make sure to check the specific requirements for the type of visa you're applying for and follow the instructions carefully. If you have any questions during the process, don't hesitate to reach out. I appreciate your help, and I'll make sure to follow the instructions closely. Thanks again. Good morning. I'm here to inquire about the visa application process. Good morning. Of course, I'd be happy to help. Which type of visa are you applying for? I'm applying for a tourist visa. I plan to visit the UK for a two week vacation. That sounds exciting. First, you'll need to fill out the visa application form. It's available online on the official website. Great. I've already started filling it out. Are there any specific documents I need to prepare? Yes. You'll need your passport, a passport sized photo, and proof of your travel arrangements, like flight bookings and accommodation reservations. Also, make sure you have travel insurance. Got it. How about proof of funds? Do I need to show my bank statements? Yes. It's advisable to provide bank statements for the last three months to demonstrate your financial stability during your stay. The consulate wants to ensure that you can cover your expenses. Understood. Is there anything else I should be aware of during the application process? Well, Make sure all your documents are in order and that you've answered all the questions on the application form accurately. Double check everything before submitting. Will do. How long does the processing usually take? Processing times can vary, but it's generally recommended to apply well in advance, at least a few weeks before your planned travel date. You can check the consulate's website for current processing times. Thank you for the information. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. If you have any more questions or need assistance, feel free to ask. Good luck with your application. Good morning. I hope you're doing well. I wanted to talk to you about the visa application process. I've been looking into it, and there are a few things I'm not quite sure about. Hi there, of course. I'd be happy to help. What specific questions do you have about the visa application? Well, firstly, I was wondering about the required documents. The list seems a bit overwhelming. Did you find it challenging to gather everything? Oh, I totally get that. It can be a bit overwhelming at first, but if you break it down, it becomes more manageable. I created a checklist and tackled it step by step. Have you started gathering your documents? Yeah, I've started, but I'm worried about the financial documentation. It seems like there's a lot they're asking for. I understand. I recommend providing clear and organized financial statements, like bank statements and proof of income. It's crucial to show stability and that you can support yourself during your stay. If you have any doubts, 
You might want to consult with an immigration advisor. That's a good point. I'll make sure everything is in order. Also, did you have any issues with the application form itself? The form can be a bit detailed, but take your time filling it out. Double check for any mistakes before submitting. If you're unsure about any section, there are usually guidance notes that come with the application form. Got it. I'll be meticulous about that. And one more thing. How long did it take for you to receive a response after submitting your application? It varied for me, but generally, it took a few weeks. Keep in mind that processing times can differ based on the type of visa and the embassy or consulate you're dealing with. Patience is key. All right. Thanks for sharing your experience. It's reassuring to hear that it's manageable with some careful planning. I'll make sure to follow your advice. You're welcome. If you have any more questions as you go through the process, feel free to reach out. Good luck with your visa application. Hey there. I've been meaning to ask you about something pretty important. I'm thinking of applying for a visa to travel abroad. Oh, really? That sounds exciting. Where are you planning to go? I'm looking at visiting the UK for a couple of weeks. Always wanted to explore London and maybe take a trip to the countryside. That's awesome. The UK has so much to offer. So, have you started the visa application process? Yeah, I've been gathering all the necessary documents, passport, travel itinerary, accommodation details, you name it. It's a bit of a paperwork marathon. Tell me about it. I applied for a visa last year. Make sure you double check everything to avoid any hiccups. Did you fill out the application form already? Not yet. That's my next step. Any tips on what I should pay extra attention to? Definitely. Make sure your information matches exactly with what's on your other documents and be thorough when explaining your purpose of visit. They love details. Got it. I'll be meticulous about that. How long did it take for your visa to get approved? It took a few weeks, but I applied well in advance. Play it safe and apply as early as possible. You never know if there might be delays. Good call. I'll get started on the application form right away. Thanks for the advice. No problem. If you have any more questions, feel free to ask. Best of luck with your application. Good morning. I hope you're doing well. I've been meaning to talk to you about something important. Hi there. Sure. What's on your mind? Well, I've decided to apply for a visa to travel to the United States. I've always wanted to explore and experience a different culture. That sounds like an exciting plan. What type of visa are you applying for? I'm going for a tourist visa. I want to visit some famous landmarks, try different cuisines, and just soak in the overall vibe of the country. Nice choice. Have you started the application process? Yes, I've gathered all the necessary documents, like my passport, travel itinerary, and proof of funds. I'm just a bit nervous about the whole interview process. 
Don't worry too much. Just be honest and confident during the interview. They're mainly looking to ensure that you have genuine intentions for your visit. True, true. I've also been working on a letter of intent, explaining the purpose of my trip and how it aligns with my personal and professional goals. That's a great idea. It shows that you're organized and have thought this through. And make sure you're well prepared to answer questions about your TIs to your home country. Absolutely. I've been researching common interview questions and practicing my responses. I want to make sure I leave a positive impression. Sounds like you're on the right track. If you need any help or advice along the way, feel free to reach out. I hope everything goes smoothly with your visa application. Thanks a lot. I appreciate your support. I'll keep you updated on how it goes. Good morning. I'm here to inquire about the visa application process. Good morning. Of course, I'd be happy to help you with that. Which type of visa are you looking to apply for? I'm planning a trip to the United States for a business conference, so I believe I need a business visa. Absolutely. The first step is to complete the online application form. Have you done that already? Yes. I filled out the form online and gathered all the necessary documents. Now I'm a bit confused about the next steps. No worries. After submitting the online form, you'll need to schedule an appointment at the U.S. Embassy or Consulate for an interview. During the interview, you'll need to provide your biometric information. Got it. How long does it usually take to get an interview appointment? It varies, but it's advisable to book it well in advance. The waiting times can be different depending on the time of the year and the embassy's workload. All right, I'll make sure to schedule that as soon as possible. Anything else I should be aware of? Yes. Make sure to bring all the required documents, including your passport, confirmation of the online application, and any supporting documents related to your business trip. Also, be prepared to answer questions about the purpose of your visit. Thank you for the guidance. I'll make sure to prepare everything accordingly. Hi there. I'm in the process of applying for a visa to travel abroad. It's a bit overwhelming, to be honest. Oh, I totally get that. I've been through the visa application process before. Which country are you planning to visit? I'm planning to visit the United States for a vacation. It's my first time, so I want to make sure everything goes smoothly. That sounds exciting. I hope you enjoy your trip. Have you gathered all the required documents? Yeah, I've got my passport, flight itinerary, and accommodation details. But the visa application form is quite detailed. Did you find any tricky parts when you applied? Not really. Just make sure to fill in all the information accurately. They're quite particular about that. Also, don't forget to include any additional documents they ask for, like proof of funds and travel insurance. Good tip. Thanks. Did you have to schedule an interview? Yes, I did. 
It's a standard part of the process. Just be prepared to discuss your travel plans and answer some general questions about your trip. Got it. I'm a bit nervous about the interview, but I guess it's just part of the deal. How long did it take for you to get your visa? It took a couple of weeks for the entire process. The waiting can be a bit nerve wracking, but just be patient. And if you have any concerns, don't hesitate to contact the consulate or embassy. Thanks for sharing your experience. It's reassuring to hear from someone who's been through it. I'll make sure to double check everything before submitting my application. No problem. I'm sure you'll be fine. Safe travels. And I hope you have an amazing time in the States. Hey there. I've been meaning to ask you about something important. Oh, hey, what's up? Well, I've been thinking about applying for a visa. I've got this amazing opportunity to travel abroad for a few months. That sounds exciting. Where are you planning to go? I'm looking at going to the UK. There's this conference I really want to attend, and I figured I could explore a bit while I'm there. Wow, the UK! That's fantastic. So, have you started the visa application process? Yeah, I've been going through the requirements and filling out the application form. It's a bit of a process, but I want to make sure everything is in order. I totally get that. Do you know what documents you need? I heard it can be a bit tricky. Yeah, I've got the basics down, passport, travel itinerary, and all that. But I'm still sorting out the finer details, like proof of accommodation and financial statements. It sounds like you're on the right track. I heard they're pretty strict about the documentation. Are you using an agency or doing it all yourself? I'm handling it myself for now. Trying to save some money, you know? But if it gets too overwhelming, I might consider an agency. Smart move. Just make sure you double check everything and don't hesitate to ask for help if you need it. You wouldn't want any hiccups in the process. Absolutely. Thanks for the advice. I just want everything to go smoothly. Fingers crossed. I'm sure you'll nail it. And think about all the amazing experiences waiting for you on the other side. Good luck with the application. Thanks. I appreciate the encouragement. I'll keep you posted on how it goes. Hey there! I've been thinking about planning a trip abroad, and I guess it's time to dive into the whole visa application process. Oh, really? That sounds exciting. Where are you planning to go? I've got my eye on exploring Europe, maybe start with France. But first things first, I need to get this visa sorted out. Absolutely. So, have you figured out which type of visa you need? Yeah, I'm thinking of going for the tourist visa. Seems like the most straightforward option for a short visit. Good call. I've heard the application process can be a bit meticulous. Have you gathered all the necessary documents? Yeah, I've got my passport, flight details, hotel reservations, and the application form. Anything else you think I might be missing? 
It sounds like you've got the basics covered. Just make sure you have proof of financial means to cover your stay. And maybe check if they require travel insurance. Got it. I'll double check on that. How about you? Have you ever applied for a visa before? Oh, yeah. Last year, I went to Japan. It was a bit nerve wracking. But once you have everything in order, it's not too bad. Just be patient with the process. Thanks for the heads up. I guess I'll submit the application online and hope for the best. That's the spirit. And don't forget to keep an eye on the processing times. You wouldn't want any last minute surprises. Absolutely. I'll keep track of that. Thanks for. Absolutely. I'll keep track of that. Thanks for the advice. If all goes well, I'll be sipping coffee in a Parisian cafe before you know it. Sounds like a plan. Good luck with the application, and I'll be crossing my fingers for your French adventure.